Welcome back to JSA TV, where we're covering the latest stories, trends, and innovations from leaders in the digital infrastructure industry live from ITW in National Harbor. And joining me today is Mike Severt. He is the president of South Reach Networks. Mike, welcome. Thanks for having us. Always a pleasure to be here with JSA TV, catching up again. Yes, yeah, always a pleasure having you. I think we last spoke at Metro Connect when you shared some exciting news about the expansion of high count fiber infrastructure across Florida. Uh, what news or what other new developments do you have today? Sure. Yeah, so a few months ago, we were excited to announce the continuation of just building out more digital infrastructure, fiber networks throughout Florida. We support a very large ecosystem today with over 370 miles of fiber, all underground from Jacksonville to Miami, locally through Boca um, and local markets. So our customer base is carrier, subsea, international, uh, content, cloud, and a lot of the fiber to the home kind of market. So with that, we're building an additional 50 plus miles, all new routes for diversity, redundancy through multiple data centers to support the growth in Florida, but also some of the new cables that are landing. So we're excited about that and uh, should be live in the next probably six to seven months. Yeah, and uh, we're also hearing so much more about your continuation of the growth of your fiber footprint. Is there any recent milestones or any previews about what's on the horizon? Sure. It's just a continuation of supporting our current customers, the growth that they have and the drivers. So some new routes being planned, as I mentioned, Boca, Miami, diversity into Hollywood, in and out of some of the new cable landings um, to support that growth, the data center growth. A few that I can't talk about just yet that'll be announced shortly. Um, in addition to the dark fiber, we also own and operate five edge pole location facilities throughout Florida. Okay. And we also provide a managed service network. So a hundred, 400 gig platform. So we're excited about the continuation of growth. Florida, as everyone known, has been a massively growing market. And, you know, with expansions into you know, Miami, all the way up through Atlanta, we're excited to continue to grow and support our customers, new and existing. Yeah. Let's dive a little bit deeper into subsea. Yep. Uh, we know that Southreach Networks is actively enhancing infrastructure to support subsea connectivity along yep. the Florida East Coast, which is my favorite coast of Florida. <laughs> uh, can you tell us a little bit more about upcoming cable landing station projects that you have in store? Sure. So our network today is the whole, you know, southeast, northeast section of Florida, Jacks to Miami. And for history of the Florida markets, many subsea legacy cables land in Florida, Jacksonville, all the way down through Miami. And through recent press and recent announcements, there's been many cables that are announced that are landing and to be landed in Florida coming into the East Coast. So we support that community today, that vertical, that infrastructure. And with some of the cables that are landing, some we can talk about, some we can't. They're current clients of ours that we support. We're excited for the growth of not only the new cables, current customers that are buying from us. We have not only some of the lowest latency routes in the market, but some of the most direct, buried, and protected rights away for the fiber. So we, we feel our network is in pole position to support the existing subsea and some of the new cables that are landing. Yeah, such exciting growth uh, down there in Florida. Is there anything else you want to add today? No, just in general, we're excited about, you know, Florida over the course of what's been happening for 20 plus years and in the past five plus years with the growth of Florida in general, just from population, but from business, connectivity, data center in, in subsea. And so we're continuing to support that ecosystem and the digital infrastructure around all that and looking to, you know, continue to support the customers and the growth. And uh, we don't see it slowing down anytime soon. Yeah, definitely not slowing down anytime soon. Yeah. Uh, where can viewers go if they want to learn more? Southreach Networks uh, website, LinkedIn. You can always get in touch with us directly through uh, you know, our marketing with JSNA as well. So easy to, easy to find. Well, thank you so much, Mike, for joining us for another episode of JSA TV here at ITW in National Harbor. And viewers, thanks for tuning in. Stay curious, stay connected, and happy networking. Thank you.